I've been working in 432 Hertz professionally for the last nine years. I have nine solo 432 Hertz albums. I've also been a session singer for 30 years. I've been singing professionally for around 30 years. I've worked with lots of different producers over the years. Four three two allows the voice to fly. It allows magic. Four three two is a natural frequency, which aligns to the human voice perfectly. When I sing in the old concert pitch of four forty, I have to practice for days to get my vocal cords tuned unnaturally. And I also have to take breaks in 432. I don't really need to practice. All I need to do is just show up. When I'm singing in 432, I can sing soprano and I can sing contralto, which is at the bottom end of the scale. So it allows my voice as a vocalist to just purely open up and really fly and have an incredible tone that I could never ever get in standard pitch tuning of 440 hertz. I teach workshops around the world. I go to sacred places and sacred sites and I use my voice and I sing in 432 hertz. I've worked with brass bands. I worked with the Royal Irish uh, Regimental Band and also educating the producers that I work with as to this frequency and how it really helps my voice. So I've been very fortunate. I've worked with Peter Rees, has worked with Enigma and Sandra and lots of really huge artists. The album was called Language of Light and he produced the whole thing in 432, having never heard of it before. Derek and I produced one of my best sellers in my whole career. Derek has produced two incredible books called Mathematical Music. Really strongly, highly recommend that you and I'm very, very honored now to be working with absolute musical genius, Craig Pruess. I recognize the resonant value of different frequencies in nature that come, and especially when it's lined with the animal kingdom. A432 is dominant in that, so why not go for these consonant tones? Namaste. couple of years doing all the Shiva chants, Rama chants, uh, Devi chants, and really getting into the Indian aspect of A432. I've been aware of the A432 for some time, but I was a bit alarmed at the fanaticism in the community. It's so beautiful to be alive at this time in the world. We couldn't have been talking about these things 20 years ago. I'm so happy that I've been able to bring it more into the mainstream. It fills me full of a lot of uh, hope. I absolutely 
absolutely advocate working in 432 hertz. It saves your vocal cords, helps my message, not only as a musician and a vocalist, but also the sound healing elements that I bring into my work. 432 actually helps people relax, rejuvenate, restore. It's been lovely to be asked to be part of this documentary on 432 because it's very, very important for humanity. Ooh, I'm a dear, I'm... 432 really does shift and change 